We got a new camera angle. I felt like the old camera angle, like it was a little awkward for Let's Plays, how it was dead on. What the fuck is up? Nice to meet you. My name is Enbert. If you're new, welcome. If you're not new, welcome back. We are continuing our journey in layers of fear with our brand new camera angle. It looks so nice and crisp. Hopefully you'll be able to see a little bit more of Young Fuzz this way as well. The last thing we left off on is we siphoned blood for our paint. And now, who knows what's gonna happen. But we're gonna do something else crazy, that's for sure. Are you ready to get scared? Oh. Of course it already starts. I forget what our painting looks like. I love this music. Oh. Oh yes, we have Shrek Swamp. What are you doing in my swamp? Oh, stop looking at me like oh. that. It's just a little something to help me focus on my work. That's all. I feel like we already saw that. I guess maybe it saved before. I'm just... So, apparently, I guess this environment changes as we progress through the game as well. So I should really be searching in here between, between every layer of fear, you know? So we got the blood, our note got updated, we read that. This is our memory journal, oh. I can't stand seeing you like this. You're not well. You were sweating and shaking all night and now there you are, locked in your workshop. Who is that? As usual, this whole tortured artist nonsense has got to stop. Aw, concerned wifey. That's okay, wife. Form emerges. Okay. Oh, that's all boarded up. Uh, oh, 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 jeez. Oh. Okay, it's locked. Okay. Okay. Oh. I forgot how immersive this game was. I'm already spooked. Oh, it's a piano. Hello, mister. You have quite a cute little face there, don't you? Ah. Oh, that kind of looked like a Wii remote for a second. Oh, oh, jeez. Lovely painting. Oh, my lamp is broken. I don't have the... About a boy who wakes up in a cave, he finds a mysterious note and a gun. He then journeys through various environments, woods, fields, rivers. Eventually he winds up at a small cabin, where it turns out this has been all a product of his subconscious, brought up by a traumatic childhood memory. He killed a guy who had murdered his father. In the real world, he's been drooling in a loony bin this whole time. Get it? The twist is sort of gimmicky, but I think it works. Could you storyboard it for me? If you're interested, I'll send you the details right away. Frankly, I think you should take this job. It pays well, and it would take your mind off of, well, you know, everything else. Please let me know as soon as possible, Thomas Caldwell. Oh, we were gonna write a scripty-poo. Oh, that door wasn't open before. What's in there? I cannot see. Alright, I guess we go into this spooky door. Hello, you gonna close on me? Yep. I caught ya. Books! The most terrifying thing in this Let's Play. And China. Fine China. Oh, it's too quiet. Something's gonna scare me. Uh... Okay. Is this door gonna be locked and then I have to go back the other way? Oh. Creator's block. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. Creator's block and jump scare. No, jump scare. No. Ah, oh, it wasn't even so. Okay, creepy corridor. Walking through the creepy corridor. I don't want to play this game anymore. Walking through the creepy corridor. Ah, oh, gee. Uh. Uh. Walking through the creepy corridor. Oh, there's a key around its neck. 
Oh, baby, no, baby. I'm gonna close you. No, I can't close you. Okay. All right. Thank you, baby. I'll be on my way. What do I do with the key? Oh, what that? Oh, wow, that changed very quickly. They're really seamless with that. That's crazy. June 9th, don't forget. Two days before my birthday. Better not forget my birthday either. Nothing. We keep the lamp on. What's in here? Nothing. All right, let's keep going. Ah! Oh! Oh! Okay. Okay. All right. Oh, I do not like lamp, 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 lamp. Oh, lamp. I love lamp. Oh, I'm all tense. Okay, drop the shoulders, relax a little bit. It's okay, nothing can get you. It's just a video game. It's just a very, very scary video game. Oh, it's a painting. That's cute. Right? What do I, what do I use the key for? Oh, books. See, I told you they were scary. More alcohol. Dominoes. Can I not read that? That looks like something I should be able to read, man. Oh, lamp. I like lamp. I'm gonna turn you on. Hey, lamp. Yeah, that's what I thought. Two words is all, in, is all it takes, you know? You just gotta say the right ones. Oh! Blind fools, ingrates, cretins. Oh! Oh, I don't like that. Ugly. Ugly. You ordered a true portrait, so that's where I painted, you fucking pleb. Maybe I need to kick some artistic sense in your stupid face! Oh, we're kind of losing it, aren't we? Oh, wow. I mean, the shading? Uh, he doesn't have any teeth, man. Uh, yeah, we'll avoid the books for now. This one. Oh. Well, that's nice. That's, I don't want really want to go down. Do I have to? Yup, alright, we're going down. Ooh. Alright. Baby, are you down, 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 DMCA. Lamp. Let me read that. Frick, dude. Anything on here? Lamp. Nothing. No, that picture. Definitely. Can I grab it? What? Nothing? Y'all suck. Sorry, my arm itches. Alright, we continue. Wait, can I go up this ladder? No. My peg leg probably prevents it. Alright, is this door gonna slam on me again? No. Thank you, door. Oh, that's super loud. Oh, can you stop while I'm reading this? I'm gonna, I gotta, I gotta mute it for myself. I gotta. Okay. If I am to be honest, I can't say your letter was unexpected. Numerous colleagues have informed me that you have previously sought their advice in this matter, and while it's a perfectly understandable, while it's perfectly understandable for a patient to demand a second opinion, I would think 16 concurring opinions would be enough. Oh, wow. Still, out of respect for you and your wife, I have examined the case thoroughly, and I have to concur with my colleagues. Involuntary muscle spasms are not uncommon with patients who have suffered burns as severe as your wife did. What you refer to as a freakish grin, or unnerving yelp, though many would find such expressions hurtful, could indeed be manifestations of nerve damage. The other symptoms you mentioned do seem to be psychological, do not seem to be psychological, but rather purely psychological in nature. 
Traumatic events can lead to severe stress that is nothing to be ashamed of. And your demand that we fix your wife, you have to understand that what she went through cannot be undone with one simple procedure. It is a long, arduous ar, 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 process <laughs> that will require all your strength and support. Please feel free to contact me or my colleagues should you wish to discuss a long-term rehabilitation program. Alright, volume back on. Alright. Where'd that go? What's in this one? Nothing. Wait. Big brain. Big brain. It was going in reverse, so we walk back the other way. Oh, jeez! Yes, yes. Hello? Where's the phone? Hello? Am I just gonna walk in circles for the whole game? Maybe I have to go back the other way? Oh no, look, a corridor. A door! Oh! Restless memories. Well, maybe they should try getting some sleep. Oh! <laughs> back! Back! Oh, oh, oh! Upside down. Flapping horror. Be quiet. Constantly flapping, eating other rats. What the heck? What if I go out, close the door, ready, and then go back in? No. What do I do? How do I flip it around? Can I turn on the light? No, I cannot. Can I go back out? Can I just leave? No. Okay, think. What would someone trapped in an upside down room do? Uh... Um, they would try to... Oh wait, what? Shattered thoughts. Okay. Alright, what does shattered thoughts have to do with an upside down room? Can I open the chest? Eh. Let me open it. Open the drawer. What falls out? Nothing. Okay. Um. Oh. Flip the switch. Genius. Big brain. Are we just gonna forget about that weird lady that appeared? Cause that really freaked me out. What What's in here now? Ah, oh, things and stuff. Okay, I'm done with you. Let me open the bottom. Nothing. You know, I'm really determined to find, like, all the fun secrets, but it's getting annoying opening every single thing. Oh! Super long corridor. Uh... Hi. Oh. Oh. Lights, lights solve all your problems. Okay. Nice and easy. Slow and steady wins the race. Uh, there's gonna be a scare. There has to be. There's gotta be. The bottle's gonna fly at me or something. Is she on the other side of this door? 
Oh, the elevator again. Gotta love it. Are we gonna go down this time? Oh, we're going down. Oh, no. When I was just a little girl, I said, Mommy, what will I be? Will I be pretty? In any case, as your lawyer, I advise you to refrain from any imprudent actions. In other words, don't do anything stupid. We still have a chance of winning this. Believe it or not, I've gotten clients out of deeper shit than this. Oh, deeper? <laughs> Whatever. Just don't make it any worse. Lay low for a while and let me appeal the court order. This social worker definitely has it in for you. We can use that to our advantage. Portray you as a victim of the system. A husband in mourning, a momentary lapse of reason, an overzealous bureau bureaucrat. Yep, I can read. Trust me, this is our best option. Considering what you've been through lately, I'd say we have a good 50-50 chance of a good outcome, but not if you keep trying to convince everyone that you've gone completely insane. No more outbursts, no more rambling, better yet, no public appearances whatsoever. You can still get your da- Oh, your daughter back. So his daughter- So what I'm think what I'm piecing together- Abandon hope while you can. Oh, that's sad. What I'm piecing together is there was a fire, his wife got severely disfigured, and they all went through some trauma. The wife probably died along the way somehow, and then the dad went insane, who's us, and then the daughter was, like, put up to foster care because he wasn't seemed fit to raise her, and then he wants to get her back. Ah, uh, yes, and this one's going to be locked. Oh. Well, that hasn't happened before. Huh. Thanks, game. What about you? Uh. Oh, hi, rats. Wash your hands. Ew. Ew, turn it off. That water's gross. Oh, bathroom! Close the door so nothing bad can get in. Flush the toilet. Flush the... Okay, can't flush the toilet. Is there anything we can grab in here? Oh! Oh! Silent floaters. They clog the drains. Fur in the water. No baths for me. Well, I don't blame you. I wouldn't want silent floaters in my baths. Why do you fill me up, fill me up, buttercup, baby, just to let me down, let me down, stop messing around. Worst of all, worst of all, you never call, baby, when you say you will, say you will, and I love you still. I need you, I need you, more than anyone, darling. Oh, interactive environment. Thank you. Light on. Light on. Locked. Of course, of course. It can never be that easy. Light on. Locked. Of course, of course. Locked, of course. Oh, wait. Wait, could I have done this in all the rooms? Let me go back. Body burrows, feeding on me, driving me insane, too fast to cut out. Oh, so he really is losing it. Can I unlock these other doors? This one, maybe. Aha! Shelf. I like shelf. Not as much as I like lamp. Oh, key. Is that natural progression? What's this door then? Oh, wait. What? This is totally a secret room. Nice. 
From love to madness, man apprehended after kidnapping his own daughter. There you go. Earlier today, a typical quiet and peaceful neighborhood witnessed a scene straight out of a crime drama as social services accompanied by armed police officers descended upon the re residence of a Scribble Man, once famous painter and a recent widower. Apparently, the man had broken into a child's care center downtown abs and absconded with one of the young patients. Our sources claim that the girl was in fact the culprit's daughter, who had previously been removed from his care after a family court ruling. So we did lose the case. After unsuccessful attempts at negotiation, fearing the man might harm the child, police officers stormed the building and apprehended the suspect. Oof. Eyewitnesses claim that as the paramedics escorted the girl out of the house, the man, still in handcuffs, fell to his knees and repeatedly exclaimed, Please, she's all I have left. A truly tragic turn. Oh, no, thank you. I do not like that doll. We will be moving on promptly. Oh, another door room. Aha! 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 You really make me go through loops, don't, don't ya? Oh. That's kind of spooky. And jump scare. Oh, really? We have to go down more? I do not like it. No, I don't. I do not like it. Turn on the light. Nope, can't do it. Is this really dark? I might have to lighten this up for the, uh... Oh. Hello. Any secrets? Any little secrets? Anything I can click on? Any little, any little thingy? Oh, the bass is, the bass is kind of loud. Like really loud. Oh wow. Oh, what's going on? Interesting. Hello, piano. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh. I knew we were in space. No, my bag of flour! Come back! Come back, I need you! I was gonna make cookies! Ah! Ah! Is there something I have to do while the piano plays? Ah. Ah. Oh. Uh. Okay. I can hardly see this. That means on the recording it's gonna be like pitch black. Oh my gosh. I needed to remove the flesh from the bone. At first, I was lost as to how, but then I sawed it off with a handsaw. Boiled it, then put the bone in a mortar. I had to get one, obviously. This was not something I'd done before. Oh, we cut off our own Finally, leg. Finally, I mixed the dust with some white paint. Oh, man. Made for a lovely undercoat. I don't think this is the titanium white that Bob Ross uses. How do I get out of this place? I just want to leave. I really just want to leave. It's so freaking dark, man. But I feel like there might be something down here. Hold on, let me turn up the brightness. Oh, now it just looks... There's, there's like no contrast. It just looks awful. Aha! Patient thirsty. 
dangling dread furry l furry okay dangling dread patient thirsty furry leeches afraid to look up oh jeez why did I look up after it said afraid to look up I don't know why gamer move let's just go back the way we came back the way we came hold up let me turn the brightness back down Cause it just it, it'll make the rest of the game look bad could you climb stairs any slower I, I shouldn't be so mean he only has one one leg so so we we flayed the skin off our leg for the canvas we sucked out our own blood for the red paint and we cut off our leg and used the bone for the white paint Let's look for stuff in here first before we put put the put the next touch on our painting. I don't see anything. But that doesn't mean there isn't anything, right? Maybe. Let me just No, those are all still locked. Yeah, I think that's Oh. No, nothing in there. Okay. Next step to the masterpiece. Oh, it's a fish. It's a little... Is that a koi fish? Huh. You know, koi fish are really expensive. I mean, some of them. Like, I've seen videos online of koi fish going for like $2 million. It's crazy. That's going to do it for this episode of Layers of Fear. I'm uh, I'm all I'm all heebie-jeebied out, and it's, dar it's, it's nighttime, so if I keep playing, I'm going to get even more scared. And that's not going to be good for any of us. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I'll be back with more of this sooner than later. Sorry I put it off a little bit. However, I'm glad that we got it up, and if you like the video, leave a thumbs up. If you dislike the video, leave a thumbs down. I don't care either way. Make sure to hit the subscribe button, but never the bell. I swear, look at me, here, 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 here. If you hit the bell, I'll be furious. Notifications aren't good for anybody. They're just annoying, and I don't want to annoy you. And as always, I'll see you next time. And burn, 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 and burn,